Once someone has undergone a spinal surgery, oftentimes surgeons order spinal precautions to be followed by the patient. These precautions help to maintain the integrity of the joints for healing purposes. These precautions are generally in place around six to eight weeks, however may last longer depending on the surgeon. Precautions must be followed until you are cleared by your surgeon. Let's discuss the different spinal precautions. To review, an easy way to remember spinal precautions is the acronym BLT. When someone has undergone spinal surgery, they want to avoid bending or rounding of the back, no lifting more than eight to 10 pounds, and no twisting of the back. Many individuals may utilize twisting of the spine when getting in and out of bed. With new precautions in place, this movement is not allowed following surgery. To avoid twisting, individuals are taught to utilize a log rolling technique. Let's discuss the proper body mechanics for the log rolling technique. During log rolling, individuals need to make sure that their shoulders and hips are in line to prevent a twisting movement. To start, the individual should bend the leg opposite from the side of the bed the person is getting out of. With the hips and shoulders in line with each other, the individual should push up and use their core muscles to move into a sitting position. To lay back down, the individual will start by laying on their side, and then while moving the hips and shoulders in the same direction, the individual will roll and lay back down. Here's an example of log rolling without the use of bed rails.